This is David Colombo's stand-up comedy reel. Um, I tell you what type of comedian I wish I was. I wish I was one of those old-time pun comedians. You know, in the suit that we don't see anymore, the one who would do the stupid joke that doesn't get the laugh, and then immediately chastises the audience for not laughing by repeating that he just told a joke. I miss those guys. Like, hey, did you guys hear about that new uh, Jack Nicholson movie? Yeah, someone where he just craps his pants for two hours. It's called About Shit. These are jokes, folks. What are you talking about? Like, I'm like giving you a second to laugh on your own. I would love to be that type of comedian, but I know that if I were, I would probably just purposely come up with the most obscure pun imaginable, just so it's ludicrous that I'm mad you didn't get it. Like, I would probably like, hey, did you guys hear about that 80 million year old Supreme Court case that just ruled in favor of segregation of giant aquatic reptiles? Yeah, it's called Plesiosaur versus Ferguson. Folks, these are jokes, come on, hey. I don't know, how long before that guy, the, uh, the homeless guy who got his face eaten off, have you seen this? Yeah. Yeah, how long before he goes on Celebrity Apprentice? I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I don't think he'll get very far, but I'm really excited to see how he'll get voted off. He'll be like, I'm sorry, you have no face. You have even less business savvy. You're fine. I'll even find a way to fuck up the right words. I'll say the right words, still find a way to fuck it up. I used to work in a restaurant and, you know, I'm a host. You gotta be jovial to everyone as they come in and, you know, this woman walks in with like her nine-year-old daughter and, you know, just trying to like make conversation and she had these like hot green pants on, the little girl. I looked at the little girl and I was like, man, I wish I could pull those pants off. The 99 cent home pregnancy test. First of all, that's a great band name. Second of all, I've only ever seen it at the checkout counter. Is that really an impulse buy? I'm just waiting for the guy who's just like, fuck yeah. Thank you for listening.